I'm going to show you how easy it is to build a multi-device C++ application using C++ Builder XE5. We'll start by building a mobile application first. File New, FireMonkey C++ Mobile Application. We can choose from one of the eight starting project templates that are available. Let's choose header and footer. So in the header label, we'll change the title to be my first C++ app. And in the client area of our application, we'll put a calendar edit component. We'll also put a T combo box. And for the T combo box, we'll, we'll add some items. And we'll also put a label, which we're going to use to display the date that we select. We'll select the calendar edit component, go to its event tab in the object inspector and we'll select the on change event handler to create an event handler for when we choose a date. We'll use the format date time function and we'll display just the, the year, month, and day for the calendar edits date that we select. So let's hit run to test this application on our iPhone. Here's the application coming up on our iPhone and if we choose the calendar edit we get the iOS native calendar control. And notice when we change the date, it appears in the label. We can also look at the combo box and see that it uses the custom picker from iOS. Back in our ID, we can also build the same application for 32-bit windows by changing the target platform to 32-bit windows. And it'll compile the application and run it on 32-bit windows. Here's the calendar edit, and here's our combo box. Now to build a 64-bit Windows application, we need to create a desktop application. So we'll say add new project, C++ FireMonkey desktop app, and we'll save this out into our same folder, and we'll call this our desktop app, and we'll create a project group for both the mobile target and the desktop target. Now we don't need this new form that was created. We'll remove it from the project and instead we'll add to our desktop app the unit from our iOS project which is called the our header footer template source file. And now to build a 32-bit Windows desktop app just hit run and again here's that application. Change the target platform to 64-bit Windows and compile and run it as a 64-bit application. We can also add an OS X platform, either building a debug version or a store version. Compile and link a Mavericks application. Here it is up here. There's my uh, calendar. Here's my combo box. And that's how easy it is to build a desktop application in C++ Builder, as well as an iOS device application in C++ Builder, using the same source code and same form, and having two projects, one a mobile target project and one a desktop project. One set of source code to allow you to build your applications for 32-bit, 64-bit Windows, OS X, and for iOS, all in C++ Builder XE5.